Volleyball is harder than it seems. Most people might think it's an easy sport, but it really isn't. It takes a lot of strategy and just like knowledge about the game. People think like, oh, you just hit a ball. No, it's way more than that. It's definitely more mental than anything. So I just moved to Florida this year. I'm a freshman. And once I moved here to Florida, I was really like sad at first about moving, but, and I wanted to give up playing volleyball. But once I met the girls, I decided like, this is what I want to do. I want to stay with it. I just made such good friends with all my teammates already, and I honestly have the bestest friends, and I couldn't ask for any more, really. Just, they're just such like, great role models. When I first came here, um, I was worried that I wouldn't make the team just because I didn't know anyone. And where I'm from in Tennessee, volleyball is really big there, so it's highly competitive. Volleyball has just like been my passion forever, and I just made like great bonds with my teammates in travel ball and in school ball, and it's just really important to me, and I feel like I make my family proud too. Definitely, you need to be ready for some big challenges, like your coach is probably going to be hard on you, and it's better to have a hard coach than an easy coach because those hard coaches are going to push you. They want to make you better and they want you to be the best that you can be. And honestly, you can't just practice in the gym. You need to go and like uh, do weights and just pushing yourself to be the best because that's going to set you ahead of everyone else. It's just like you have to just honestly keep a positive attitude. You know, that's like cheesy, but that's it's true. And just encouraging your teammates always helps and just being a great teammate it just keeps a positive energy up. I definitely think anyone could be a good volleyball player as long as you have the mentality to work harder and always to get better. You can't just come in thinking you're the best. There's always someone that's going to be better than you and you have to understand that. You need to have good grades no matter what. If you don't play sports, if you're in the band or anything. You should always have good grades because that's really important to me and it should be to everyone else, you know, to your parents and everything. Um, I think just having like a great personality too, with every new person you meet, you should inter introduce yourself politely and just respect others no matter what. And just being a great friend to everyone if you know, if you see someone down at school, just be their friend, just like, because I would want someone to be like that towards me. Every team I've been on, I've always met good friends and I've always like connected with the girls because we all have something in common, so you just need to find common interest. I would want to play volleyball in college because my brother got a uh, full scholarship for football, so I don't really want to like let my parents down necessarily, even though they wouldn't be like mad or anything, but I think I want to be a narcotic like investigator in the CIA. I wanted to be a lawyer for a little bit but then I decided maybe that wasn't a job for me so I think I want to do something in the CIA. Yes.